Hi, Mr. G here, again with another rap session. Um, this is projects that are based off of recycled arts. So we are using paper today to make a mosaic. And a mosaic is a group of small pieces of paper that make an image. And again, this is the magazine mosaic um, rap session lesson plan. So you will need a blank piece of paper, some glue. You will also need a pencil. We are going to make uh, a roadmap for the image that we're gonna recreate. And I'm gonna do a sunset today, um, just because the trying times that we've had, um, just looking for a little bit of peace and relaxation. So we're gonna get started. So I'm gonna draw that out for you guys. And as I said, um, usually when drawing a sunset, you would use a ruler, but today since we have a magazine and we're using recycled goods, we can use this as the straight edge that we're going to do our horizon line with. So I draw a horizon line directly across my paper. And again, you guys don't have to do what I do. You guys can make any image that you want to, but this is the one that I chose, okay? Now I'm drawing the mountains off to the side of the image now. And I'm doing it on both sides. And I might give myself a squiggly line to represent water. And then I'm gonna do an oval for the sun. And I might s decide that I wanna see some birds flying around. So I'll draw this. Okay, so now I have a version that I've started to build up here that have pieces that I've glued down. Now I want you guys to start to think about color. You notice that I used a baby blue for the water. You notice that I'm using a black for the outline and that I made the birds with that too and also for the horizon line. You guys can use any colors that you deem appropriate. Um, these are just the ones that I decided to use. Now coming back to our magazine, we're going to open it up and see if there's any colors that you might want to do. And you could also take a colored marker, pencil or anything and start to map out your colors on there, seeing that you're going to glue pieces of paper over that. Just so that you can give yourself an accurate roadmap of what you want to create. So I'm looking at, I want to build up the sunset and I'm thinking about colors that I want in a sunset and how sunsets work. Now there's many ways to go about this. You can look at photo reference for that to see maybe a color scheme that you want. So I'm going to do a little bit of a gradient and I'm going to build the gradient up from a reddish type of brown color to a yellow co color. And we're going to start to put those pieces in now. Oh, also, one golden rule of thumb, use a piece of paper to glue down your stuff so that you're not getting anything on a table, tablecloth, or any of your parents or loved ones good stuff. We're just gonna start to build it up. And also, the biggest rule, ask if you can cut these things out of magazines, books, newspapers, or anything else that you choose. Because if somebody wanted that, you don't want to get in trouble for being creative. Now, I don't want you to get in trouble for being creative. And let's talk about imagery that's unique to you. This is your mosaic. So whatever imagery that you choose that is, um, represents you, I think is a great thing to do. Like I said, you, I did a sunset, you do not have to. And then we'll glue on a couple more pieces and you'll see this start to take shape a little bit.
And then I would go about cutting out a few more pieces to fill up the top. I'm gonna stop right here for right now, um, but I encourage you guys to make pieces, have fun, be creative, and learn how to work with little scraps of piece of paper called mosaics to make an image. Um, I hope that you guys had fun um, developing an image in this style and making a roadmap, drawing, and creating. This is Mr. G, and thanks again.